Ah. Oh. Um. Sorry. I, I, I had my music on. Did you say something, miss? What? No. I don't have a problem with you. No, 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 no. I wasn't staring and thinking about making fun of you, I promise. But, okay. I, I know being stared at was absolutely rude and creepy, but I mean no harm. I didn't want to be mean to you, n nor was I judging you. I... I... I just... I, th I think you're attractive, okay? Huh? No, it's not a joke. It's not meant to be. I got here to work out without a single coffee or anything, so... I'm super tired, but... When I saw that there was someone here at the gym at 2am, I got curious and looked over, so... I saw you, and... Okay, I'm, I'm breathing, I'm just... Not used to talking to people. Especially not that cute. I prefer coming here, but... No one's around, it's more comfortable for me. No one is around at this time except for me. And now, you? So that's why you're here too. You're the same as me. <laughs> is this your first time at this gym? I could guess. When you're doing the treadmill, your form was a little off while stretching as well. It's fine for a newbie though. Don't 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 fret about it. It just takes time to learn what every machine does. My first time in a gym was a disaster. I almost dropped a weight on my foot. After that, I got so embarrassed that I never went back. It took me about six months to get the courage to come back. <laughs> but welcome, newbie. I guess you'll see me often if you keep coming by. No, no, I'm not saying this to intimidate you. I want you to be comfortable here. And I want everyone to feel safe while working out, so just, just be at ease. I'm a, I'm a very chill guy, by the way. But I didn't make a good first impression. Good job, idiot. My worst habit? Why do you want to know that? Fine, I, I'll tell you. you. You may judge me, but... I... Eat way too often in bed. Narrowly avoiding that problem, but what can I say? A lot of activities are more fun and comfy when under a comforter or some sheets. Didn't think I was that much of a monster, huh? So, how about you, newbie? That's a common vice to a lot of people and understandable, actually, especially for me. I can't cook to save my life. Some people can work miracles with food, and all you have to do is pay them and the people who bring it to you. It's a pretty sweet deal, right? I can even recommend you some restaurants if you'd like. Also, weight can be a sensitive subject for a lot of people. People get lured into the idea of losing weight quickly and easily by predators that just want to lure them into their schemes. Stupid fad diets as well. It can work sometimes, for sure. But losing weight, it needs to be accompanied by the desire to improve ourselves, not for other people. But sometimes, we're already amazing as we are. So we just need to help ourselves and to accept how amazing we are. And to some people, that can be more difficult than lifting a ton of weight. What I wanted to say is that I'll gladly give you advice if you want and, and help you with the process. Maybe the idea of having me as your personal trainer could be a little uncomfortable after what just happened, but 
I'd like to encourage you whenever I can. Huh? The lifting? You need a lot of help to master this one. Maybe you'd be surprised at how much weight you can actually lift. Hmm, crazy. What made you think that? What's wrong? Not, not to your liking? How much can I lift? <laughs> That's a loaded question, newbie, but... I bet you'd be impressed if you could see me lift you up. What? You want me to do 20 squats while holding you? Okay. I, I accept. I'll show you, but you're going to have to help me out here. Okay, so we're going to do 20 squats and I'll need you to help me stay balanced unless you want me to fall on top of you. So wrap your legs around my waist. <clears throat> Count with me. One. Two. Hmm? Oh, I didn't tell you before. I'm, I'm, I'm one of the owners and partners of the gym. Don't lose the count now. Three. Hey, don't think too much about it. A job is a job, you know? Four. Yeah, I'm, I'm fine, newbie, but your, your face is really flushed. Are you okay? Five. You think it's because of your weight? Listen to me for a moment, okay? You are as light as a feather in my arms. Actually, I'm doing it slowly because I want to take my time while holding you. So don't worry about me, newbie. This is a piece of cake. I know that I still sound very creepy. Plus, I admitted to thinking you're hot when I just met you. It's also an idiot thing for me to do, but... Still don't believe me that I think you're hot? It's the truth, and I don't get why anyone would make fun of your body. Let me take you to the mirror with me. There. Look at yourself. I know it's hard, but just listen to me. Take a look at yourself. A long and deep stare in the mirror at all your body. Maybe you're angry at yourself for how your reflection looks. I see your eyes trying to look away, but give me a chance. Is it okay if I keep holding you? I know I haven't finished the squats yet, but put it on hold for now, newbie. Let me show you what I saw since the second I laid my eyes on you. I promise I can make you change your mind. Six. They're perfect. Your legs, like a painting. Curvy and soft. Makes me think about running my hands over them. Mm. Shh. Don't move too much. We're both going to fall. Seven. Sorry, I went too far again, didn't I? But this is only one of the many things I can tell you. Are you getting tired? Should we stop? Me? No, newbie, I'm having fun here. Eight. Oh. Can you see it? How satisfying are the arches of your calves and hips? 
balanced with your torso, now arched when I'm lifting you up like this. This is the vision of paradise. Nine. So when I tell you that I fell in love with you at first sight, please believe me. Now, can we talk about your lips? I just love how pouty they are. Just a little pursed every time you talk to me. Like you're deep in thought, and man, when you're glaring, I mean. Damn, I could fall on my knees right now. <laughs> oh, I do love getting into trouble, it's true, but do you hate it? Even your hands and arms, the way you're trying not to pull my shirt while I move is so cute. Your arms tensing up above mine. The way your hairs get up every time you shiver. Also makes me shiver, newbie. And the question is, should we keep at it? Or should we make this even more challenging? I want you to have a full understanding of how much your body needs to be worshipped right now. Every single inch of it. We only have 10 squats left, so I'll make it worth it. 